y'all, welcome on IGY6 Games, the gamer channel that brings you a variety of entertainment and content, Bo here in the year, and before we kick things off, we'd appreciate the love by y'all sharing and hitting those icons that need to clicking. With that said, check out our social meds where we post daily, and we keep in touch with our followers, now let go. We're late, we're late for a very important date. That's right, agents. Title update five is to be released on Tuesday, 23rd of July. Of course, this is only for us agents who chipped in that additional 40, 60 US dollars. What's that? 30, 30 to 45 ish euros? Let us know in the comments section. I'm too lazy to Google that Shiza. Back to the topic at hand. To clarify, Year One Pass Agents release is Tuesday the 23rd July, and y'all poor folk, Tuesday the 30th of July. I didn't mean to call y'all poor, Jesus. I don't even have a vehicle. Although it did get jacked, but that's for another time. With Title Update 5, we like get two way. new main missions. Camp White Oak, which is described as bring the traitor, President Andrew Ellis, never even knew he was a traitor, to justice as you assault a presidential compound in the woods. Next main mission is Manning National Zoo, which is described as Emmeline Shaw, leader of the Outcast has holed up in the zoo hey, hey, to hey, regain buddy, buddy. her strength. Agents here, will Tom. hunt down and eliminate Shaw to keep the outcast from reclaiming power to the city. So that's the two new main missions. Another addition to new content is expeditions and investigation areas. When agents receive what appears to be final broadcasts from a military convoy at Kinley College, Expeditions are split into three different wings for players to complete. Each wing has a specific theme and tone and will be open to players on a weekly basis. So essentially, this all sounds like it's going to be the new West Side Pier from TD1. These expeditions are a new activity in TD2 where you can explore a new area, solve puzzles, West Side Pier, anybody? And of course, discard some enemies that you encounter there. There are different rewards, again, West Side Pier, that you can collect and where you can finish all three areas. There are also the premium rewards. Thirsty for more? We also have oh, two new out. classified assignments. Yeah. They will be located at Washington up, Central yeah. Aquarium and NSA Site B1 Tree. That's three. B13. How about that? But wait, there's more. We're also getting discovery mode for the raid. Dark hours, of course. There is not a new raid, just to clarify. I don't know, like, Which they describe as not as difficult. <laughs> shit, yeah, we had I that by. Yeah, you okay. the... Alright, we haven't. Yeah, we are uh, console gamers. Yeah, oh, so money, give us that. Blue. And we haven't tried as much <laughs> as we'd like to have. But, Shoot guess what? TD2 has it. solved it because they're adding oh, matchmaking in this. Thank God. All right, get ready. I Somebody swear to God, if we do not get this raid complete two weeks within this new release, Got I'm going to go fucking feet. berserk. There you go. And if that's not we'll enough, that. we also get a new apparel cage dropping right. on the 23rd. Fuck, feet. I'm still trying to get the goddamn cowboy hat. Damn. All right, now. That was a lot. No sarcasm. I'm not even mad. That's impressive, TD2 Dev Team. Let's hope this is a hit. And for y'all non-year one pass owners, that doesn't mean hold off till the 30th. 
on the 23rd. All balance and changes will be updated and discovery mode for Operation Dark Hours will be available. So y'all have at it. And as we close out, hope you got what you came for. Share with your mates. Click those buttons that need the clicking. Want to catch us in action? Check out the squad as we stream. Schedule down below in the description. Swing on by and say hello. And as always, I say peace.